Yo, what's up guys, welcome back to a brand new Roblox Studio video. My name's Lobby, and today guys, we're back in Roblox Studio. And today guys, I'm going to be showing you guys how to add a mute and unmute button inside your very own Roblox game. Just to make it clear, today I'm going to be showing you how to add a mute and unmute button inside your very own Roblox game. Meaning, you can mute the audio at any time, and you can also unmute the audio at any time. But anyway, let's get into the video. Okay, so you're going to want to load into your base plate or game that you want to add the music to and add the mute and unmute button into. So for this uh, demonstration, I'm going to be using a base plate. And you're going to also want your explorer and properties open. So to get your explorer and properties open, go to the top bar here and click view. You'll see explorer and properties are just over here. Make sure they are pressed down and they should pop up on your screen somewhere around on your screen okay you so now we have got explorer and properties open what we're going to want to do is go to workspace here in explorer and click the the arrow plus there and then we want to now search up sound just like that and now we're going to want to right click and rename it we're going to want to rename it to music or with the scripts and all that won't work so we'll just do music just like that music and now you're going to want to go find your audio that you want to put in the the game so you can find the audio in the roblox library a link to that will be down in the description below but yeah let's go find some audio okay so we are now in the roblox library where all the audio is all this will be linked down below so don't worry about it as you can see there are tons of audios you can choose from like there's tons of pages um, so you'll surely find one for your game so just grab any one. For this uh, tutorial, I'm going to be using the Wii Music. What you're going to want to do, you're going to want to go grab the whole entire link. So you can go Control A and then Control C, or you can right click Copy. So we want to take this whole entire link now back to Roblox Studio. Okay, so we're now back at Roblox Studio. You're going to want to go back to Explorer here and make sure music is highlighted. And you should see all this other different information here. We're going to want to go to the sound ID area. Sound ID, just there. We want to click on that and go Control V or paste. And then we just want to press enter. As you can see, we have now got the ID in there. And you just want to go back to music and do looped and playing. So what these do, playing is so the audio is actually playing while you're in the game. And looped is so once the the music finishes it will repeat if that makes sense but yeah now we have uh, checked playing and checked looped we are now get ready to move on to the scripting part okay now we have set up our music we're gonna want to go to starter GUI you're gonna press the plus button just here and go to screen GUI if it doesn't show up there to search up screen GUI and it will come up so press screen GUI Okay, now that we have got the screen GUI, you're going to want to go back here and press the arrow, uh, the plus right next to screen GUI to click on text button. So now that we have the text button, what you're going to want to do is you can adjust this all you want. You can change the color of the background, I don't really mind. But for this tutorial, all we're going to do is adjust the text. So we're just going to go to text scaled so it becomes a little bit bigger. And then we're going to adjust the text here. So. We're going to change it to mute slash unmute, um, un, unmute music. There we are. Now it should pop up just like that. You can adjust the colors and everything you really want. Um, but for this tutorial, we're just going to keep it like that. Now we're going to go to the position. So now I'm adjusting the position of where the button is going to be placed. For this tutorial, I'm going to just put it just in the middle of the screen on the left. So we're going to go here. You can you can even drag this if you really want, but I'm just going to do it like this. I'm just going to add 400. As you can see there, now it is 400. Now let's just press enter. And now as you can see, it is in the middle of the, the left-hand side of the screen. Now that we have adjusted everything that we need to adjust for the text button, we're going to want to go back to text button and make sure it is highlighted and press the plus button. And we want to click local script. Now it should open us up to a local script. Now that we are in the local script, what you're going to want to do is remove the print hello world. Just go and delete that. And now you want to copy the 
the script down in uh, the description below and then paste it in the local script. It should just look like that. Obviously, this will the script will be down in the description below and probably in the comments. So just go and copy that and paste it in there. You can do Control V or right click and paste. Either way is fine. Now that is basically it. As you can see, we've finished the local script. Now we're going to want to go and test it. To easily test your game, all you're going to want to do is go to the top of your screen and press the play icon here. We'll just press play. And now when we join, the music should start playing. As you guys can hear, the music is playing, the Wii music in the background. And then when we press uh, mute music, it should mute. There we are. And it is muted. And then we press it again. And now it's unmuted. And then press it again. And as you can see, it is now muted and there is no music in the game whatsoever. Also, make sure that your uh, in-game volume is actually up not all the way down or you this won't be able to work so yeah also guys if you guys are a bit confused and don't really know what to do feel free to dm me on discord i'll happily help you out and give you some advice and give you instructions on what to do so feel free to dm me on discord a link will be to my discord server will be down in the description below but anyway guys i'm gonna wrap up the video here if you guys did enjoy the video i'd really appreciate it if you guys could drop a like and subscribe i'd really really appreciate it but I'll see everyone in the next video. Peace.